All right, here we are. We're going to be working today on a couple of TVs. First is a, well, not first, but first <laughs> is an RCA XL100. Don't know if it actually works. I, it was on the side of the road. It had a sign on it that said free works. Uh, as you can see, it's kind of filthy, and CRT is covered in crap. Looks like nicotine. Could have been a smoker set. Don't know how old it is. The manual, um, the label off of the back of the set is missing. It's only a partial. I know it was made September of some year. Uh, it's a standard uh, click tune. Um, the other set here is a Crown Japan, made in China, color set, both are 19 inch. This one's got an electronic tuner, um, one of the ones that you preset like that. And the Crown is from 1989. I know this because it's the first um, new TV we ever had. My dad actually won it at a, a raffle at work one year, and uh, you know it's been in the garage for about four years now. So don't know if it works anymore. Got my converter box here hooked up to an antenna, and converter box is hooked up to the RCA through the 300 ohm connectors. There's no 75 ohm connector. And here's the back with the remnants of the uh, label. But the good thing is, you know, everything here looks at like your, uh, my drive, the red, green, and blue drive, and bias. Uh, it's kind of hard to see, but they don't look like they've been messed with too much, which is good. So, if they were all hard over, it would be a general indication that the tube was shot. And here's the back of the Crown, model uh, CTV-X19. I did have the back off of this once, and... This one does have a uh, Samsung tube in it. So probably it is made by Samsung, or at least pretty much made by Samsung. And then there's the back on this. It's switchable for 75 or 300 ohm. Got my cleaning products here. I'm gonna clean them up first before I do anything. Then we will uh, work with them. All right, did a little cleaning. And the, the RCA is looking better. I can at least see a picture. I can see something. Like clean glass. And so is the crown. This is what's left. I mean, most of that was off the face of the tube. Here's my public service announcement for today. Why would anyone smoke? Because that goes inside your lungs. That's nasty. I just turned on the power here. I turn on my converter box. Get a few channels up because I think I left it on 13, which I won't get out here. Let's see what we get. That's interesting. Did I do something really dumb here? No, RFR, VHFN. I had it on four. I thought I had it on three. Works. Hmm. No, it doesn't work. <laughs> All right. No, I got nothing coming to the tuner. Oh, someone just really diddled with things. Okay. I'm laying here for a minute. No, seriously. And I, y'all may agree with me and bang on. Oh, yeah, the picture. In the car with and I agree with that. Off. Let's get to a channel that's stronger. There's trucks and SUVs. Some of graphics. There we go. Eh, not bad for first. Oh, convergence is way off. Um, 
convergence is way off. Um, colors off, brightness off. I can diddle with it a little bit, but it's producing a picture. <coughs> let's switch over to the other one. As you can see, I disconnected the RCA from the converter box. Got the crown here. The standby button. Check two. Interesting. Um, <laughs> purity is way off. I'm wondering if it's the RCA causing the issue. No. Eh, it needs degauss. Maybe the degaussing coil isn't working. So the audio is. Audio's not working. Oh, no, there it is. That picture's not half bad, other than it being... I didn't hear the degauss and fire the first time. That's well, not too bad. Colors are jacked up because center of the tube magnetized. Convergence is still fairly good. So, I don't know, they both work. I'm going to see about this. No, uh, <laughs> yeah, no degaussing thing. I'm going to mess with the RCA a bit. Pull the back off because i got to get to where the convergence is. Alright, I've gotten the back cover off. It's fairly filthy in here. But what I have found is it's a RCA CTC 120 chassis. And the model number is FMR 4525W. And there's there's where you get to see that's the CTC 120, and the CRT is original. It is a A 48 AA B 11 X, and it says made in the USA. So I'm guessing this whole set was made in uh, Indianapolis. Now it is absolutely disgusting in here, so I'm going to, uh, you know. Dust it, unfilthy it. Now that is interesting. RCA TV. Now look who made the tuner. <laughs> okay. So that's interesting. I'm going to have to find the convergence adjustments because I can't. I don't see them. They're not. None, they're not extremely obvious in this set. Most of the later ones, they're strapped around the tube here. Well, let me clean this up a little bit, and then uh, get you a look down in there. It is on. That's why I'm trying to be a little careful. So this 117 chassis, I think, was the remote controlled one. So. Okay, that's the inside, and that's a good look, and I'm going to clean it up now.